Uh, let me see. Looks like Streamlabs forgot my headset again. Yes, Streamlabs. Still that one. There we go. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Trader Life Sim. Episode 8 already. <laughs> it's going quickly. And, uh, hello, hello, everyone. Hey, Sean, Marion, Sapphire, Refill, Edgar is here. Hello, Edgar. Gordon, hello. That time I'm about seven hours behind on this series. Well, just, I mean, join in. The rest you can always watch back. If you want to. Hey, Hans. Hey, Nightmare. Hello, hello. Uh, yeah, I have. Uh, oh, That's better. I uh, I had a bit of a migraine this weekend. It lasted a couple of days until I felt uh, better. So today I'm back. Did mean I had to catch up on some housework today. You know, laundry waits for no one. So it's a bit of a later stream. But here we are. Let's go loading. Now it's gonna be a weird week anyway. You know, with uh, with Christmas and everything coming up. Hey pigs. Hey Royal! Hello, hello. <laughs> What's up, 3 a.m. again? Oh boy, I know that feeling. Oh boy, it's 3 a.m. Yeah. Alright, there has been an update in between, but I didn't want to make this stream about the update because, well, the update's not really finished yet. So here's the thing the dev wants a lot. He wants a lot, and he's just alone. And everyone who's playing this game also wants a lot. He wants more items to sell. He wants more stores. Um, multiplayer is something he's going to be looking into. You know, when he gets the chance. He also wants a Steam Workshop. That he's been talking about. Uh, let me check my stats real quick before we do a look around. Actually, that's pretty good. So let me, oh wait, map. Let us see. I think the only one he really, uh, is, is this the, no, that's the electronics store. Yeah, yeah, the electronics, jabber, housewares, clothing, equipment. Here's the gaming store. Here's new furniture. But here's used. These two are new. However, we're gonna take a look. They're not open yet. The items aren't in the game yet. So, but we are gonna take a look at the new stores. Now he posted a, uh, a roadmap. However, it's basically telling us when update five, six, seven, and eight are coming. Update 4 just came out. That's the one I'm going to show you now. Uh, yeah, Jabba was updated too. We'll take a look at it on the way back. Um, so, but he didn't tell us what's actually going to be in those updates. It's also to not, you know, not promise anything, I think. That's an assumption on my, my part. Let us see. So last week he added the... Uh, that's electronics, yes. Here's, oh, here's Jabber. Oh wait, that looks... Oh look, he's, Jabber's getting in new stuff, guys. <laughs> that's awesome, I love that. That's such a good one. And he has some cars in front of the door now, those weren't there before. He did have boxes, now let me see. He said there was shelves with space for more yeah coming soon so there's gonna be new stuff on there and then there's gonna be some other stuff as well okay interesting so we're gonna get new stuff oh there he is hey Debor. how you doing i was uh showing everyone the changes of 4.0 but since it, ha it doesn't add much yet to the gameplay, I didn't want to make it like the subject. 
I'm really curious if you're gonna do anything with this high-speed internet. You're gonna get a an internet store, internet cafe, oh, internet cafe simulator. That's what you have at Beach. <laughs> um. Oh. Decoration store coming soon. Interesting. Front. Look how shiny. No, I am not. I can't see myself. Wait, we have a bathroom in the house? Okay, oh, hold on. I'll go back home just a bit. A decoration shop. I am not sure what we're gonna get in products there, but it sounds interesting. Oh yeah, there's a furniture shop. Did I try? Oh yeah, there's the gaming store and here's a toy shop. Oh, I like the front. Look at the little truck. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, are these uh, are these items coming in 5.0 or is it something for later? She didn't actually tell us what was coming in those updates in the roadmap. So yeah, lots of new products coming. I saw in the review some on Steam today. Because I'm also live on Steam right now, so I, ch I check out the reviews occasionally. And it's like, yeah, I compared it to one, so they said I compared it to one. And they honestly thought it didn't add much, because and there were less items in the game. But yeah, two is just not finished yet. More items are coming, more stores are coming, as you just saw behind us. I just pointed with my thumb behind me, like you guys could see that. It's Get a Steam controller for Christmas, so you can play it. I I never play with controllers. Can you not play this with an Xbox controller? Oh, I think that was requested actually in uh, controller update. I'm sure it's on his list. The bank. Alright, let's quickly go home so we can see uh, what happened in there. I didn't know there anything. Oh, yeah. That little bump might be a little smoothing. <laughs> I keep hitting it. Let me see. I didn't know there was actually something changed inside the house. Ah, yes, yes. So the stacking is still coming with the optimization update then probably, if you can manage it at least. I mean, that's a lot on your own. Let me see. Oh, you added a door! I think someone actually commented on that in, the, in a review that there were no doors in the house. However, English was clearly not their native language, so... I wasn't... I'm actually wondering how you would... How would you furnish this? Honestly, I would make the room with the... Even if it's smaller, I would make the room with the windows, the, the living room. And that's of course the bedroom. And then this would be the kitchen, even if it's huge. Well, it could be a storage place, too. Wait, you said there was a bathroom. Bathroom in your house? I, am I blind? I, I thought that this was it, but... Oh, did you mean just the room? There's a room for a bathroom, like that. Yes, this is... 
Honestly, I didn't pay a whole lot of attention to the house, I must confess. So I didn't realize there was an extra room there. <laughs> Sorry. But I like it. Yeah, we needed an extra room because... Of course, it was quite possible to... Uh, to put walls in yourself and make like a small... Um, a small bathroom in the bedroom, but it obviously would make it a weird room. I can, um, I can certainly decorate the house sometime. Oh, um, now I'm wondering, the decoration store, is that decorations we are going to sell? Or are those decorations for us to use to decorate? Or both. Could be both, of course, as long as you don't put it on a shelf, it won't sell. Look, welcome to the floof and safe knee mart. <laughs> I still love that name. It doesn't fit on my starting screen, but there you go. Oh, I knew there were buyable doors, yes. Okay, how am I doing? Let me see. Oh, okay. Maybe polite to close the door. Hardware store. Honestly, how 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 are we gonna fit everything into our store? That's the question. <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking like the items could be both, because as long as you don't put it on a table or a shelf, or maybe yeah, would it be po like if I buy like a vase, right? And I don't want it for sale. Would it be possible to do that? Well, you could also just say don't put it on the table. But we, we need the core tables that don't sell items. That might be a good one. Let me see. I had some couple of things still to put, put away. Let's do that real quick. And it looks like I already have the money to buy the upgrades. That was quick, I didn't expect it that fast. I'm, uh, I'm making good money. Did you guys see my new clothing area? It's awesome. Yeah, the caps are still... The, the, um, the color texture is not on the cap itself, I think? Or... No, that's the head I'm seeing. And the... Yeah, the... The top of the head is colored. That's what I'm seeing. The caps are just see-through. I already told you about that. It doesn't make sense to sell tools in the supermarket. Um... Honestly, I think you're right. I'm um, I'm trying to imagine like we have this big store uh, here uh, where we we go on occasion to buy some stuff, and they have like mostly food on the ground floor, but these supermarket items, you know, um, baking items, uh, foods, everything like that, cat cat stuff, and and then they have like electronics, clothes on the floor, the top floor. But they don't have tools. So, yeah, realistically, that makes perfect sense to me. Sunshine, orange juice. Wait, is it orange juice? No, it's carrot juice. Sorry, my mistake, it's carrot juice. <laughs> Lighting needs some rework. You mean in the in the in the store or in the game in general? I mean, if you look at the shadows, they're a bit strong, right? There, there's not enough diffusion in them. But that's something that's see you see that a lot in this engine, so it doesn't really bother me. 
Lighting is causing the textures. Ah, okay. Well, honestly, no rush on that one. <laughs> I for me, I don't care. A lot. Like, it would be nice if you could fix it sometime, but I'd rather have more more items and uh, optimization and stacking. Especially the stacking. Oh man, it doesn't fit. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yeah, it's in the fridge. Good. Always check if you're working on the edge. It's, uh... Oh yeah, these are the small bottles. That's right. This, this is orange juice. Yeah, stacking is coming. <coughs> oh, I did see the toy screenshot. Yes. Mm -hmm. The the big supermarket that I'm talking about does sell. Well, maybe not entire desktops, but they do do sell like stuff like this, guitars. Um, Maybe if it was like a special, maybe a special deal or something. I'm, I really like this clothing area now. <laughs> I would put that up because it's a little bit separate. What's there is something? Um, maybe we can put down a little bench. I'll have to see if I can buy like a little bench to put here, or maybe just here, and keep that as a. You know, people need to need to sit down to fit the, you know, to try out their shoes, right? That's what's missing. No, I could see a, a guitar being like a special deal in a supermarket occasionally but tools is usually something that you would only find in a hardware store well that's not actually no the Lidl here has occasional tools like they have the you know, do it at home your home week or something, and they'll have tools and equipment and I don't know uh, screws and toolboxes and all the good stuff. I just realized that's actually uh, once every month. More coffee. I am missing some drinks. I'm missing the smoothies. I thought I bought those. Clearly not. Yeah. I see something here. Is this that's just space left over? I think it's just space left over. Probably had these two in three rows. All right. Anything I can uh, get? Shampoo. Diapers is full. Cleaning spray. Mm. Not. Well, actually, if I shovel along I can fit that in there what I actually want to do is um, let, let these shelves empty out a bit I want to get rid of these boxes first and then we're gonna because I want to get new shelving and I don't want to have to move 55,000 items Already coded the stacking. Once done, I tested the stupid cashier started selling the lower products, left the upper ones floating. Well, that happened in one as well. But yeah, I can see how it looks a little bit weird. Mm. 
Yeah, so we're gonna get that upgrade to... Well, as soon as I'm done with this. I'm just wondering if you can... Because it's a lot, right? You're adding a lot of products. Can you add a second floor? I don't really... Maybe I... I don't really need it, I don't think. I was just thinking. One box key. Yes, we can put that in. We can make it so that the food area is separate from the non-food area. With shelves or whatever we want. Uh, oh, that's right. I kept buying hair oil instead of the body oil. So now I have way too much of the stuff. And what do we have here? Two biscuits. Okay, there we go. Oh no, there's there's a light. There's the boxes under there too. Dog food, pretty full. Corn snack. Full. All right. Uh, we're doing well. See, what do I have? I'll buy those sometime, no rush. Don't even need them. So how much are we getting in from all those upgrades now? Can I see that? Oh, here we go. I did calculate it sometime. Let's see, uh, 150, 225, 315, 415, 565, uh, 765. Hold on, it's probably easier to go the other way, actually. Uh, 659, 1100, 1250. 1665, there you go. Okay, thank you. It's not that hard, I just lost my count for a second. Oh, is our shop wearing them still 100%? Alright, here we go, last upgrade. Oh, I need to put it. Oh, that's right. I always forget that. I always forget that I need to put it on my bank card. So, would the lighting fix also fix the reflective clothing people are wearing? Now, don't get me wrong, I actually quite like it. They're all, everyone's very shiny. Hey, Picker! Okay. Let's do it. There we go. Let's see what it looks like. Yeah, that's what I thought would fix that too. Yeah, exactly where I thought it would happen. Got a little bit of clipping there. Not a big deal. Just make a picture to let you know. Um, all right. Now the, the only downside I'm seeing here is that I wanted to add another fridge. Question is, if we can stack these three and these three, do we need to? Do we need another fridge? Not really. I have enough space to get everything in there. Oh, 
Yeah, the, that box sticking out, that's what we ignore. <laughs> I need to move those fridges a little bit more this way. To line it up with that wall. I can do that. Let's, let's leave it empty, uh, to empty out and we'll do that. <laughs> I'm th oh, sorry, I'm thinking what... <laughs> I'm thinking should we do the fridges elsewhere? Another option is to basically use... Add, I could add two more fridges if I pleased. And make a, a kind of wall here. I like it open though, I really like that. Okay, so what's gonna happen is obviously we're gonna get more fruit and uh, nicer fruit and veggie stands. Um, we could move... I don't know how much space that's gonna take up. Depending on that, we're gonna move those tables over there. And get some, some, maybe more of those tables. I really like those, even if they're not the most practical. <laughs> Make the new expanded area for food products. Um, honestly, this wall, because of the size, is perfect for the smaller food shelves. Also, if I get boxes and such. From the load, uh, from the pallet over there, it's very handy to have them right here. Hmm. Yeah, it's basically you have to make a choice, right? Where do you want the food items? So. Th this all. Where do you want the non food? Now, logic states you would put the more expensive non food items in the back of the store. Though, let's be honest here, thieves can be very bold. I remember the story. I used to work in a bit of a fancy liquor store. Like, they, they carried quite expensive stuff, uh, at least some of it. Um, all price ranges, basically. And there was one time where... <laughs> it picks it, see there. Uh, one time, so my um, boss back then told me that... Um, so you have to imagine that um, there was a really small shop. So basically, you walk through the door and you walk past the counter and then on your left hand side would be, you know, beers and, and sodas and a bit of furniture shop would be the wines. Behind the counter would be the more expensive whiskeys and such. This person walks in, jumps the counter, grabs the most expensive bottle, jumps back over and runs away. That's just, you know, <laughs> so it doesn't really matter where you put stuff. They are going to steal it anyway. Hey, sad. Yeah, yeah, there are electronics. Hmm. Hey, Jewel. Okay, so I bought the upgrade. Mm. You know, is there something in this store we can we can use it like a little little bench or something? Might just have to go to the new uh, new furniture though. I mean, we could put up a really ugly chair that would <laughs> <laughs> make perfect sense. All of steam is down? Really? Oh, 
Oh, yeah. You're right. You want cookies? Sure, give me all the cookies. Um, team anyway. Yep, Steam's down. Well, we're just gonna continue and hopefully we'll reconnect with Steam sometime. It's fine. Um, well, there's an upgrade to the car, but there is a uh, there are two other cars in the game, pigs. Is that a heater? Yeah, it is a heater. I am very tempted to buy this thing just so people can fit it, can put, you know what, let's do it. Okay. <laughs> a little joke there. We'll buy something nicer later. Oh, change colors and such. Yeah, that would be cool. Right, that would be nice. I agree, that's a very good suggestion. Just like in Ranch Sim, where you can. Um, they actually work with. Um, oh, what's the name again? With those. The color codes, the numbers and letters. So you can pick out uh, any color and just uh, make, make your car that color. There. Now people can try on shoes. Perfect. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Adding your own lights. Yeah, that's... No, it's already quite bright in the store. Hey, we just... Hey, that's weird. Just sold two sweepers. Yeah. Now we're gonna get... This table is more of a test, because this is the cheapest item you can buy to sell stuff off. I'm gonna get rid of that because it's ugly. Mm, yeah, so okay, so the clothing area is gonna be the same. I'm wondering, what should I buy first? Measurement-wise, it would be smart to buy the veggie stuff first. I really want to get everything on better shelving. Oh, it's Tuesday, isn't it? Yeah. Should have expected that. It's Tuesday. Uh, Tuesday is uh, steam maintenance. No, usually it's a little bit later than this. It's fine though. It'll be back up. Okay, I'm, I'm just thinking because I've had in my head for a long time now that I was going to keep all the, the the basic supermarket items, all of these, all the Jabba stuff, here. And now I'm doubting myself. Because I don't have enough fridge space. It is an option to simply place fridge here. You see what I mean? And then make a little bit of a separate area behind there. That is an option. Basically use the fridge as a wall. It would still be open above it. I don't see where else I could put the fridges because I don't really want the fridges in the middle of the path because they're so high. You can't look over them, so it would make it very claustrophobic. Just like the shelving. <clears throat> an option is though to get lower shelving. Actually, I say that. Is that an option? Hold on, I need to take care of myself and then we'll... Seems uh... still down, yep. Or I'm just free. Oh, oh no. What happened? I thought I put. I, th I thought I turned this. The caps protection off.
Well, in the meantime, why don't I give away another key? Well, I'll What's fix this? that setting. Click the right, yeah, trade life sim 2. There you go. Um, Let me change this. <laughs> the Steam's... Wait, Steam's been hacked? Well, the game's still running, so I think we'll be okay for now. If I suddenly disappear, it's because Steam's been hacked, okay? <laughs> now I'm really curious, actually. What's the Steam website still doing? Working, sorry. <laughs> that was a Dutch thing. Eh, not perfect, but it's working. It's loading. It'll be fine. Uh, yeah, I was gonna take care of myself, and we're gonna visit the the store, equipment store. Poor Dborg can suddenly get timed out for using caps lock. <laughs> I fixed that though, it's because I accidentally left. Well, not accidentally, but I just realized it's not important. <sighs> if you do a 100% caps message, it's gonna time you out. It's like, ah, nah, let's not do that. Okay, we're already back to 5k because I yapped so much. Perfect. Let's go. Swoosh. So, giveaway for Trader Life Simulator 2 running right now. That exclamation mark raffle. <clears throat> and if you win, make sure to say hello and send me a message on the Discord. No, no, a little bit further. Here's equipment. Hey, let me take a look at uh, furniture for a second. A bump there. <laughs> nope, it's not fixed yet. It's still funny. This would make nice benches too for, uh, for the clothing area. Let's see, I like my little flower chair. And that's also something nice you can put in the store to make, you know, fill it up a little bit. Could buy ourselves a better toilet than bath. That might be a good one. Um, I 
Oh, it's... I was like, why is the stove so small? But it's just... It's a loose oven. Is this a loose item? Yes. They need to buy those separate. Big fridge. Green. Oh, bills, bills, bills. Honestly, if you expand the store, it might be a good idea to uh, uh, make the electricity bills higher. There we go. Chat's back up. Let me quickly check if um, the stream's back up. Yeah, it'll check there. Oh, excuse me. Um. Doesn't look like the stream's back up. Let's give it a little bit more time. Otherwise, I could quickly restart it. Prefer not to, but if that's what it takes. But yeah, this is all mostly furniture for the house. So you could use it in your store. You know, this would be a nice one too for like shoes and such. But I like the double shelf one. This looks like something that belongs in a second hand store. Wasn't there a new stool to stand on? I guess you could use that. Hey Otto, I'm afraid I don't know what that means. So, uh, please keep it in English. You know what, let's, let's spoil ourselves and get a new bathtub and toilet. It's an expensive plant. This one's nice. We'll come back for more uh, later. Oh yeah. I wonder. Someone talked about this. You can't do that. Okay. <laughs> that's that's just perfect. Ah, no, he doesn't come with. Okay. I had to try. <laughs> yeah, these these lines don't do it. The others do. It's a toilet car, yeah. It's a real shame you can't drive with it. Okay, so I bought a couple of other things. We'll have to come back to the equipment store then. Because I can only carry five. Know, which one is wider? It's hard to see. I don't think it matters all that much. Can I get next to this one? I can't, can I? I wanted to measure it a little bit. No. I'll be back for more once I know how much more we need. <laughs> hey, Marion.
put it in this bash and just see them put it in the sweet salt <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, hold hold. Is that bottle new? Or did I just not notice? Sorry of my life, honestly. Is that new or did I not notice it before? <laughs> I like it though. Uh, oil and gas is okay for now. Okay. Streams back up on Steam. Sorry, I just wanted to check that real quick. No need to restart. Perfect. Yeah, it's steam maintenance evening. It's a fan. Usually it doesn't take long. better if there were more vending machines here. Though of course we already have all the candy we want over there. So what kind of vending machines? Oh, I know. In Japan, especially in Japan, you probably have it elsewhere too, but I only know it from videos about Japan. You have vending machines for like hot food. There was this vending machine you just put money in and it makes a whole plate of hot curry for you. Or a pizza, or I've seen that one too, and things like that. That would be awesome. <laughs> Make that the final upgrade. <laughs> the gigantic food machine. Okay, how big are you? Because we all know how useless I am on measurements. Um, imagining measurements. You're actually quite a bit lower than I thought. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. So everything big would have to be at the bottom. Moderation, this shelf is really small. I thought it would, yeah. Honestly, size-wise, this one's way better. But it doesn't look nice, does it? I have to see if there's something I can put the bigger items on. Let's see, this is one of the biggest I have. Uh, okay, that's, that's a no, I think. Yeah, no. <laughs> I wish it was a nice shelf that it was a big, a bit bigger. Uh, I'll put you there for now. Just a little bit of uh, decoration. Uh, yeah, let's sell these. Oh, but this one's tiny. It's, a, it's also not dressed up like a bathtub. It's just... There's supposed to be like a little wall around it. It's fine though. It looks a lot better. Ha <laughs> ha! 
bad. <laughs> oh, I just realized that the toilet is way bigger than the bathtub. The, the top side's way too high. Yeah, that's good. It's a tiny bathtub. <laughs> you stack that table. But you mean on something else? I guess I guess everyone already has this game. It's not gonna be hard to pick a winner, is it, pigs? Congratulations! Send me a message on Discord and I will send you your key. Not the right order again, there we go. Can you stack a table on a table? That is my question. Mm. Well, let's let's try it. Oh yeah. That's a yes. That is an interesting idea. That's the tea would the still the tea would still not fit, but if you use this one it would. Of course you could also just put it at the bottom. I actually suggested uh, a pallet. Yeah, if you stick stack, sorry, stack these two. Just put this to the side here. That's a good idea. No, sorry, I'm sorry I'm a bit quiet. I'm just thinking really hard. So if I were to get more of say this one, right? And I stack them on top of each other. And put Oh no, because you can't put anything on the floor, can you? And I don't think there's anything no kind of shelf that's actually on the floor. I don't think so. We'll go back to the equipment store tomorrow. I'm just wondering. There's something here. Let me check. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, the downside of the one with the, the shoes on it is that uh, the tea doesn't... It, it sticks through the shelf, the board itself. It doesn't really look nice. You could do it. Yeah, this is more, so more something for like cans. Honestly, that wouldn't even be a bad idea, but I don't think that fits really well in the store. No, there's, there's nothing here I could put on the floor so you could still sell items.
But you could use it to put some boxes there and such. Big items you need to fill up more anyway than the small ones. So, uh, here. Because I was thinking the same thing, right? If you put it on this one, but see how it... How it sticks through. I don't, are you, which one's higher of you two? The bottle. The bottle's higher. Wait there for a moment. Yeah. And then you can't put anything else on there. But for the really big things... I, yeah, well this one could certainly work. So the bottom would work here. Let's see. Yeah, that fits. But that's also an option. He, it also really depends on what he's gonna be adding in the in Java store with the next coming updates. Because there is new stuff coming. I like it though, but I really wish that it was just a big bigger. I mean, just, you know, p take a corner and pull. Um, just make this shelf this height and then just the, what do you call that? Um, exactly the same, just bigger in size. <laughs> can I put shoes on that shelf? Yes, I can. You can you can also put uh, veggies on the shelf if you wanted to mix and match. Yeah, um, I'm just, I'm sorry. I'm trying to think of a word. What's it called? Sorry, sometimes I annoy myself. I have the word contrast in my head and that's not what I meant. Um, so the height and the width... They would be comparably still the same. So they're the, still the same word. I can't think of it. It's store editor mode, yeah. Just flip to the ceiling. <laughs> or almost the ceiling then. Yeah. No, you can't put stuff on the floor anymore. <clears throat> so in 2, Dibor made a very clear choice that he did not want people to be able to put stuff on the floor. And he also didn't want people to be able to make huge towers of items uh, to, to not have to buy shelves. So basically you could make yourself a bunch of money without investing anything in your store, which makes no sense. So it was a, a balancing thing. I, uh, I agree with that. I did ask for pallets, and, and he can make them expensive too, just to make keep the balance. Make them 500 bucks. It would make no sense to make them 500 bucks, but it would allow you to, uh, you know, you keep people from buying it at the beginning of the game. And you can, once you can, we can stack, we can actually make towers of things that make sense. So make a tower of diapers or make a tower of toilet paper. No, you can't put it on a box either. You need to put it on a shelf or a table. What, what would be a nice addition and that might be something I, I don't know if that's possible. So, um, 
what what some stores do is they take a box they put that box on the shelf and then there would be they would cut out like a piece here and then rip off the top usually boxes are pre-cut for that and then uh, so you have to take your stuff out of the box but the person doesn't need to take every single item out of the box. What you could do in the game is put it on the shelf, press a button to unpack, and then it would simply put your items on the shelf. But I can see how impossible that would be if you compare just these two sizes. It would be nice though. <laughs> I'm really bummed out that this thing is so small. Got it. It's hard to compare things because they're in different stores. Ah, actually, no, they're not. I lied. They're not in different stores, they're just not next to each other. The cheap shelf is at the entrance, and the expensive shelf is in the back. Yeah, I agree, Gordon. It. <clears throat> what you could do in one was basically just buy some stuff, put it anywhere in your store, and people would still buy it. So you didn't have to buy shelves. It does make it easier to make quick money. And I miss being able to put the, the, the bigger boxes, um, like however you want them. Just like we couldn't make a pyramid with those video cards. That would be nice. Whee! Okay, back to the equipment store. And take a closer look. Oh, right, here's the furniture store. Now that uh, Jewel gave me the idea to stack tables as a shelving. <laughs> it's still funny. Let me see here. You know, you could buy this and then put like a. Oh no, I think that's an equipment too. It is an option though. But it would have to fit. Um, hold on, got a little turned around. Where's the equipment? A little bit back. Right here. Right here. What do you sell from a carpet? Now, my head says probably not, because he made it so you could only sell from shelves. My gamer mode says that's it, that's it. How much is a carpet? I don't think I saw a carpet in a second-hand store. Let me see how expensive they are. I might check the second-hand store first. Yeah. Wow, five feet. This is a nice one to put at the entrance of your store, though. Though I'm not a f the the shadow around it is really extreme. It makes it look like it's floating. Are these the only two there are? Okay, let's go. I'm gonna test this. <laughs> well, if it works with the carpet, we wouldn't need a pallet now, would we? If it doesn't work, I have a nice carpet for my house. 
all right let me see maybe i made the wrong cho choice in shelving you know what i think i did because this shelving is higher isn't it I, no actually no look at the shelf itself it's not it just it looks higher because this wall is higher in the back This one is higher, meaning you're missing this extra space here. So no, this one, I think this one has a little bit of wider shelving though. But honestly, I don't really care. Um, oh, there, there is a shelf there. Honestly, I didn't see it. She's looking straight at it. <laughs> Tire height. Uh, hold on, this is not the most pleasant song in the list. Oh, and actually, this is pretty nice. Oh, no, not that button. Wrong button. Uh, let me see. These are also an option for bigger items, but I think it's actually pretty much the same as that one. Except they, they're missing the top shelf. Hmm. Actually, I think the only one that really works. Uh, yeah, this one doesn't work either. So yeah, the shelf in the in the secondhand store would be a good one to use. What about you? You're actually more expensive, so that's no use. Um, the same story. I know what we can do. If I buy this little fridge, and we'll, we'll find the space for it somewhere, but maybe against the glass or something, we can put all the little bottles from the fridge in there. And then I don't need, and if we can stack the meats later on, I don't need more fridge space. Or I could, and, and one of these too, for ice cream. Yeah, yeah, that would work. Yeah, that works. That means that I, the fridges are in the perfect spot right now. Should we buy this? Mm -hmm. Um, I don't know what would fit. I'm gonna. F I have two of these now, so I'm gonna see what fits first. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna buy this one until I can stack. It's not no use. Um, I really like this one best. I know these ones are a lot cheaper, but this one just looks the nicest. Okay, there we go. That gives us an option to start... Uh... Oh, honestly, I could use this one also for bigger items. It's an option. Or the shelves I already have. They're, op they're options. Honestly, we want to get rid of those metal shelves though, because they're not the prettiest. Though those wooden, wooden ones, just stacked, would be a good solution. Oh yeah, I went to. Did you want to see the new shops? I can go again. I don't mind. Hold on, I was right there. I might want to get some oil too, actually, while I'm here. Oh, uh, where was the oil again? Repair? Here, okay. We'll do that on the way back. So, Jabber has just some more space for more stuff. It's not the most interesting addition. 
Yeah, so that's the game store. We saw that one last time. And these are new. The items will be added. This one. There we go. That's the best one for the screen. So we have a decoration store. And a toy shop. With a little... Little truck. Right? It looks nice, right? Look at the floor, I really like it. Oh, but um, no, the gas is pretty much full. It's uh, The oil is basically just, you know, repair your car, maintenance. Oh, 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 fine, we'll do that. I was, I was going forward instead of backwards, but this works as well. Let's go. Um, I honestly don't remember if he gave us dates on that roadmap. I'd have to check. I can check, hold on. I'll check for you guys. I know the optimization and stacking updates not coming until next year. Oh yeah, that was that response. Let me see, where is the... Um, here, let me give you guys a link. December 27th is going to be update number 5, and then the rest is in the new year. There you go, there's the link to the, the roadmap. stream again in the there got my link back for steam because that's running again and of course what I posted earlier is gone so now it's back perfect yeah, no problem. So it doesn't, he's not very explicit about what's coming in which update. I mean, he's just working on this alone, so I can understand that. Especially, well, he doesn't celebrate Christmas, obviously, but. Well, obviously, no, not obviously, but he doesn't. I just, yeah, I'm assuming, aren't I? Uh, oh yeah, this is, uh, I didn't mean to be rude. Let's just ignore it. I don't know. I'm assuming he's not celebrating Christmas. Because he's from a Muslim country. There you go. Fixed. See, I made it. No, no, he doesn't have a team. He did have a team, but he was very honest about that, that... They worked on a couple of games because he's from a country where there's a uh, war going on, not Ukraine. Um, and he just didn't have the opportunity and the internet and the, the power even, the literal electricity to work on games. So he hired some people, but they were too slow, way too slow. And you can see it in a couple of the last games. They're, they can't compare to this game. They really can't. I'm honestly hoping he might put a little bit of effort in those games himself to make them a lot better. But yeah, this is this is his baby at the moment, so let's let's go with that. <laughs> yeah, it's, see, it, it wasn't a. I just realized I was assuming things, but it wasn't a bad assumption. It was. I mean, ah, you know what I mean. Ah, people are too delicate nowadays, I think. 
So, how much shelving can we? Let, okay, let's let's do this. Hold on, this is gonna be a bit messy. But honestly, three would probably fit perfectly. Could we fit a little one next to that? How far would that go? So a little one's the half of this, right? So it would be this. That's, that's tight. I don't think that would work. Maybe. I do have to put the fridge a little bit this way, but I think it will be fine. Yeah. Okay, let me t put those two here for just a moment. So I bought a, li a little, little fridge. Can I put you outside? Like, can I put you here? Would that work? Let's test it. We're gonna do a couple of tests, peeps. Hold on, I want that a little bit. Uh, oh yeah, and I have these vegetable stands, so they would go uh, You need to go to the side. It's gonna be a bit messy for a little bit because I want to measure this out a little bit Honestly, they wouldn't even be wider it Would give me a lot more space I like that. I like that a lot. Mm -hmm. We're gonna switch those over pretty soon. I'll see. I... Now I'm really curious. Is there one that would be as white? Okay, so see what I did here. I'm, I measured this out, right? Hold on. Um, so this is just as white as this. I mean, it's not perfect, but it, it's basically that. I can't really do that with this one because they're deeper than they're white. The two are two are deeper than one is white. I wonder if there's one. There was one that was. Another option would be to do this and take two, but then I'd have to do this. Oh no, I could I could make a hole in the middle again. It's quite hard to show you what I mean. How white would they be then if I did that? Be quite big. Maybe I should just put them like so. Would probably and, and not have a headpiece. Would probably look better. How many do we need to make it approximately the same size? Okay, well, no, hold on, that's actually not an easy measurement. <laughs> so, three, I think we could fit four. That's a lot of space though. Do we need that? Probably. Yeah, that works.
but okay but say we did this right so we have these shelves set up on this side I'm gonna try something out okay so um, yes thank you <laughs> I'll take that maybe just this no none none of the sizes match in this game okay that's good to know Honestly, I could have just better bought some more. It looks weird, doesn't it? I don't know it looks weird I think I'm just gonna try to put the bigger items I mean it is an option yes it would work but I think I'm gonna put the bigger items um... oh yeah right uh, where, where did I put that carpet uh, the bigger items on the bottom shelf because they do fit there they're not that many, especially if I buy more shelving. Okay, no, I think I like these better for the non-food. Not, not to put them back again. <laughs> I really effed myself over with this one. Yeah, that's good enough for now. We're gonna change everything anyway. decoration okay so we can it was four right sorry I need to know for sure before I buy more Yeah, we can add four. So that's eight. So I need to buy six more. And one big one and a half one, I think. Hey, Glenn, auto grid would be nice, yes. Uh, but there's um, on the floor, you can see. Oh, I'm hungry. I need to go eat. Um, you can see the lining. I use that. It works. Also, I have patience. <laughs> I don't mind so much. Uh, not having grit. I know it can get annoying, but it does give you more freedom. Let me use my new toilet. Brand spanking new. My tiny, tiny wash soap. Yeah, that's... Honestly, some things just 
miss. Um, see, that's the same word I can't. A comparison of a comparison of size. One is bigger than the other. Then they're. Oh, I can't think of the word. Problems when not speaking your native language. For how do you? Um, Google, help me. <laughs> I need help. <laughs> Hold on. English. No, that's not the translation I'm looking for because there's more than one. Ratio, that's a good one. Proportion. That's the word I'm looking for. We're, we're here, everyone. We're made it. So what I wanted to say about the shelving, the proportion would stay the same. But it would just be bigger. Is that the ratio? Yeah, I guess ratio would work. Okay. We're going to see if these... I, I put everything I had of these items on here. We're going to see if that sells. I don't think it will. But we're, we're going to test it out. Oh, wait, wait, I forgot to test, my goodness, the drinks outside. Oh, I actually drank it. Oh, wait. Are they in the fridge? Yes, they count as in the fridge. Good. Alright, let's test this. I was looking for of uh, for how uh, for howding was the word in Dutch. So this is so the proportions in the game are a bit off sometimes. Like the the toilet is huge, the bathtub is really small, um, the cauliflowers are small, but the cucumbers are huge. Yeah, proportion. I just couldn't think of it. It happens sometimes when you're speaking another language. I mean, it happens when I speak my own language. <laughs> and honestly, I'd rather just Google it than trying to, you know, figure out what it is. Sad, isn't it? He added a new bathroom to the house. <laughs> I'm not even have the toilet in there. <laughs> oh, it's the police again. Hi. I honestly wish he had added the new Jabber items already. Because that would allow me to set up the final... Final way it's gonna be set up. Layout. That. Ah, but I can always change stuff around again. A shame that I can uh, only carry five uh, equipment items once. Furniture. Wait, he didn't post a picture, did he? Oh, hold on.
Oh, oh, stop, stop the car. Um, I'm going to take a sneak peek. Let's see, those are the toys. Those look nice. Let's see, I see pickles, wheat biscuits, and batteries. But he might have switched some things around. Let's see, that looks the same. Picture's not the clearest. It's in the link on Steam I just posted. And I think those are bouillon blocks. Fuck blocks. New bottle of soap. Yeah, I think that's about it. It's not too much. I can easily switch things around. Uh, so I might want to keep some more space with the cookies especially. And the jars. Uh, I drove past it again, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> it happens. Batteries for the toys, exactly. Yeah, the, the I posted the link for the Steam. There's a picture there of the toys they're gonna add. Okay, we haven't had a complaint yet, which is basically a miracle. Okay, let's start with this one, because to replace all the veggies, I need at least four more. Preferably six. I'll get some of these later on. Yeah, I can't afford those either. So let's just get started and we'll see how it goes. Um. Yeah, no, I don't really have anything. Where would you put it? Now, you don't really need it because the store's already so light. This one would look nice at the entrance, but what would you put in it? Candy? I'm gonna take it with me and we're gonna decide there. Let's see how much we can fit in there. I can always sell it again if I don't use it. Uh, no wait, I think I'm actually going the right way already. Because I had to turn around. What the hell did I just sell? Oh, I got my dailies in, of course. I was like, where the hell did the money come from? Um, honestly, that means I can just... I forgot about that. There we go. Hmm. You can fit one of these in there. Hmm. I think for continu continuity, this one would look better. This one would give extra space for the jars and such, though. Question is, do we need more room for the big stuff, or do we need more room for the small stuff? I also think the bottom shelf is going to be really annoying to stock. Let's just get this one. I can always buy, like, something silly to put, sh to put cans on, honestly. Um... Yeah, the veggies can wait a bit. I also want to stock the shelves again one, a bit once I have them set up. I let them go pretty bare. Let's go. Ooh. 
beep. Now, of course, the planning is going to be to have every single item, well, almost every single item in the store. But obviously, I would like it all, but I don't buy items when they're very expensive. So it's going to be a bit of a luck thing, too. But eventually, we'll probably have every item in the store that's available. So, okay, we have a clothes section. I'm going to build the supermarket section now. We have the cooling section which I'm now testing if I can put that outside have a little cooler with bottles I just want to I don't know if I'm gonna keep it there I just want to know if it works I am testing if I can sell things from a carpet sorry <laughs> I want to set up a veggie area He's been complaining about. I have no idea if that works. Punch. Trying to see if any drinks got sold. Milk. Tropical drink. But. Oh, yeah, hold on. Let me move them all out so I know for sure. I think I put all the tropical drinks. Oh, no, that's a can. Sorry. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. I couldn't use in time. Um, no, the tropical drink is a can. Cherry juice. I, yeah, that's that one. Um, I don't think there was one left in it. Yeah, I think it's working. You can put shelving outside. Oh, thank you very much, Glenn. If you wanted to, you could build this whole front part. Just hold up. You could put. You could make a fruit and veggie market outside. If you wanted to. I'm so tempted. Now, I need a spot where people don't walk. Let me put my car to the side here. It's gonna be really hard to get that straight here, but...
Let me another pick one. I don't know if this works. Watermelon someday. Put them up here, actually. Oh, that looks so much better than that shelf. I just want to know if I can put a whole fruit and veggie garden outside. <laughs> All the melons are outside, that's the best way to, to test it. Let's actually fill up the shelves too. Get rid of some of these boxes. So I can place everything easier. Carrots. Oh right, we actually, uh, we last time we were talking about it too, the fact that there's lots of different colored carrots. We actually bought a package of uh, colored carrots. I'll be probably eating them tomorrow. I'll post a picture on the Discord if anyone is curious. <laughs> someone asked, sorry, I'm just, memories make me laugh sometimes. Uh, someone asked in the Discord, like, why, why do the potatoes need so much space? And I was like, oh, don't say it. Don't say it. I was like, my, but in my head I was going like, yeah, otherwise they start a fight or um, they just need their space, you know, things like that. <laughs> the hitbox. Why do they need so much space? The traumatized the traumatados. <laughs> oh, we need a better name for them. Um, Um, they're not really black, and then it's hard to see. They're more like dark purple. They're a bit darker than that, I know, though. The only thing we have then is some carrots and some lettuce, that's fine. No, not no melons sold yet. I have so many products it doesn't go that fast the, the selling of items. So, do I have candy? I do. Oh yeah, and, and gum? I can't really test how many bags would fit in here. Not two to the side, unless you do this and it looks stupid. Right. Two, three maybe? 
Mm. Add a little bit of pushy, you could fit four gum on there. What else would you put on there? I don't think the soda cans. That's gonna be a lot of work, and also it would be nice to put those together. Wow, I'm really, really low on everything, aren't I? Now, don't get me wrong, I would, that was supposed to happen. I'm supposed to finally get low on all this stuff. We're gonna move, or have to move everything. And these seasoning packs, um, well, I mean, officially this one? It's called, uh, what's it called? Cheese Mild, but it's an enchilada kit. I guess you could call that a seasoning pack. I did see there's uh, stock, uh, stock blocks, I guess you could call it, they're coming. Ah, one short. see that logo I mean yeah okay it's it's not the logo but it's very close <laughs> the logo that shall not be mentioned here I think I like it better inside though looks wise but it's not bad You know, if we do get the ice cream thing, or maybe I should put. Oh, does that fit? Considering how they walk, it would if I move that plant. I think that would fit. I'm wondering if I should move this inside. But where would we put it? Here? I could put this shelf here and then put like a freezer for ice cream there. You know the things you buy when you when you're standing in line. Um, that's also a good question. How long does it take for something to ruin? Well, what, what time is it? It is six. Let's test it in the morning. Let's test it in the morning. Because it will spoil. I don't know if these are selling. Let's check complaints. Ah, no, we got a complaint about the tea. So this does not sell. Let me put that back. It was a good test, but it, it doesn't work. Put it back on the shelf and hope that a little bit sells. I'm trying to empty the shelves a little bit before we switch them out because it's gonna be a, especially all these cans and such. It's gonna be a lot of moving. Fridges too. That's not so hard because they're not going to move very far. I am worried about things spoiling.
What I want to do is move this fridge so it lines up with... It lines up pretty well, actually, but I still see a big part of the backside of the fridge. The corner's a bit weird here. Because these walls are glitching a little bit. I just want to make it so I don't see the backside of the fridge so much. Play it a little bit bit more that way. That would also make it easier for me to see if I can fit a little a little one there next to the big shelves. But that that little one here. Hey Ashley, Merry Christmas to you. Thank you very much. Is there a card with steps? Um Oh, you just reminded me. I think he did say there was something added to the game, wasn't there? Let me do a little quick check here. Let me see. Okay, update 4.0. Uh, I should probably put that in the title. Add a new option, mouse sensitivity. My oh, actually, my mouse sensitivity is pretty good. So, added new walls and doors to the player's house. We did see that. Uh, he added the new stores. They're just not open yet. We did see uh, that new shelf in the Jabber shop for new items. Added a stool to the player's shop, which can be used to reach higher shelves. Meat shop has been adjusted and the game store has been adjusted as well. And then he also fixed some boxes. Box, box. Not boxes. <laughs> to visit those then. Um, now, I already had this stool. So. I don't think we're selling any. But nobody asked for melons either. I'm running out of breads because I'm so busy with the shelves there. Not a sausage bread. Oh, let me quickly go grab some. Honestly, you could make like a whole area outside here. Selling more drinks. Yeah, look, we sold the bottle in the back, so this works. You can put stuff outside. Good to know, good to know. Oh yeah, now now we're getting busy with making it actually look good. Let me just run to grab some bread, because that's the only area that's... Well, that and the clothes section, that's just completely finished. Mm. No, the cake can wait. Let me grab two of those. We'll come back tomorrow, see if it's something else is cheap. I'm thinking you need some stars or something. A moon. That's what we're missing. We're missing a damn moon. <laughs> uh, baguette. And sausage bread. Oh, well, for those of you who missed it last time, you can also put items on top of these shelfings. So let's say you have a couple of breads left over, you can just put them on top here. Or whatever you want. You can also put other items on here. Candies, chips, cookies. If you want your cookies up here, you can do that.
Uh, I think I put you guys a little bit too wide, honestly. Alright, just making sure I have enough space for the sausage bread. is uh, 100. Hold on, this box is really in the way. There we go. Um, but I honestly don't really know how many for how many days you get the bill. I usually have around 200 bucks in my inventory. Honestly, I have way, way more enough space for sausage bread. You need to be so difficult. There we go. Look at my, my glorious shoe fitting chair. I love it so much. Yeah, what should we do with you? So I can't sell items from a carpet. Oh yeah, oh this one, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I had to, I don't have any control about the playlist. So on the playlist, they don't like this song. Uh, where are we in the playlist? Oh wait, I can just press next. There we go being difficult again. There. Much better. Or should we put it in front of the entrance? Would that be better? I knew I had some use for it. Um, let me do a quick check. There. Yeah. There he is. <laughs> Edgar's been a member for 27 months. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Edgar. <laughs> Wowzy. <laughs> Wowza, even. By the chair in the shoe department. Oh, that's a good one too. I feel it's honestly be a little bit too close to the bathtub. It's okay for now. I like it there though. I like people having a little mat uh, for them to come in. Let me just put it straight. Hold on. I don't like that it's not straight. There we go. Where the dude was my car. <laughs> I could always buy another one for next to the chair. But for now I'm gonna be working on the shelves, so I wanna save up for all the fruit and veggie shelves we're gonna need. I think I'm still gonna do it inside though, just because it looks better. But it's nice to know that you can put it if you're really short on space, you can just put your stuff outside. I, oh, I remember now, in Trader Life Sim 1, I had a table outside with all the melon, the watermelons on it. Yeah, so look, he added new doors. And uh, well, something you can use as a bathroom. We'll, uh, we'll work on some furniture too. Hey, Kino. How are you doing? Oh, 
let's... I just realized that Pix has talked, but he hasn't actually uh, reacted to winning the giveaway. Well, let me start another one. I don't know, anyone still wants to win this game? I know I gave away a lot of keys. So sometimes people are like, yeah, did I already have the game. <laughs> Let's try. <laughs> Played all night, slept all morning. Yeah, that's how it works. Oh yeah, I'll find picks, no worries. He's won before. <laughs> Not this game, of course, but other games. Hi, how are your prizes today? Doing much better. Hmm. Let's see, I still had cake. I'll take some more sauce and bread. <laughs> oh, I just saw you say yes. <laughs> I thought you were just chatting. I, I was just checking if you knew you'd won. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're here. You're here. I know that. It's all good. Well, another giveaway just started. Anyone wants uh, a key? I have a very big chance to win one. <laughs> Hold on, I'll fix it. Just need to shovel a little bit. The cake needs to be in the fridge, so it's not like I can put it elsewhere for just a moment. They're all in the fridge, right? Yes. There we go. All full. Can I fit three next to each other without sticking it through the wind uh, to the window? No. <laughs> Watching is more fun than uh, than playing it. I, I can see the attraction, yeah. Simply because it's... Uh, yeah, uh, it's a lot of stacking. We'll just put some breads on here. There we go. And it's not sticking through the, the window.
Wow, I spaced that out very differently. Oh uh, yeah, I can fit that one next to that too. <laughs> well, there's a giveaway still going on for this game if you want to win it, anyone. Uh, I, get, I did give away a lot of keys already. It doesn't fit. We'll just pretend these are packaged. <laughs> there you go. What do we have here? Banana bread. Box here. is fully stocked are you finally running empty a bit a bit yes let's get rid of these boxes for just a little bit What I can do is simply remove the, the, the leave everything there. Remove the shelves, place the new shelves, and then move the items directly onto the shelves. I think I should be able to do that. Selling pump or pumpkin melons? No, we're not. Might be too far away. I don't know where the line is. Yeah, these are selling, I think. Body oil. Okay, let's uh, let's give it a go. I'm just gonna put these shelves in the corner here for a little bit. I'm not quite sure if I want to want to use them or sell them. Stuff still good. Is it gonna be in the way? I didn't think it would. Oh, it's because I'm trying to stack it on top of those chips. That's why. In the worst, we'll just move a couple of items here. No, it's still. These are just in the way. Okay, let's quickly put move them. It's okay, at least I don't have to move every single item that was on the shelf. This is gonna drop my rating a bit, but that's okay. I'll fix that in a jiffy. I'm gonna stack all these shelves first anyway before I go and... Uh, yeah, the problem here is that I can't see where I'm putting this shelf because of the shelf that I see in my hand. Can't see if it's straight at all. <laughs> That's a big no for me, Bob. 
Empty's Queen, thank you very much for subscribing. Oh yeah, now you can see how much smaller these shelves are. See how far this one extends. I'll find a way to fit it all in though. I can add other shelves, other kinds of shelves. I can put all the, the canned drinks elsewhere. No, that's not far enough to the left here. Uh, right, sorry, other left. So it's really hard to see. Hold on. Not enough to the right yet. Is it straight though? Not completely either. Oh, well, I'm stuck. Hold up. <laughs> Can't stack on the stand on these shelves either. Good to know. Hard to see. <laughs> I'm looking at the tiles. This one's really closer to that edge as that one. Yeah, it's not much difference. I don't don't get stuck again. Hold on. Frank it on these bottles here. <laughs> All the floating items here. Oh wait. Um. I think it looks okay. Let me see with the next one. Do I need to move anything? Yeah, those those bottles. Oh. Clearing my view. What am I hitting? a little bit through that bar here but that's okay I'm trying to move it perfectly so I never have to do this ever again. Can you be patient with me? <laughs> oh, thank you, Jewel. Thank you. Well, you're, I think you're the only one entering so far, so uh, your chances of winning are really good. You just have to send me a message on Discord to get your key. You know, and say something if you win. 
Otherwise, I don't know if you know. actually got a key for um oh what's the name again i'm oh, sorry i'm too many games in the mind uh was it my gamer shop i think you're just right on time for the giveaway too uh no actually the the timer stopped again i i restarted it in case anyone wants to join Okay, let me... I, I can't really see what I'm doing. I think you're in the way. I'll get a little bit farther away. Hold on. Why are you not... It doesn't seem to be lining up. That's a problem. Let me see how it looks. It's a little bit farther away than this one. Honestly, it's not bad though. It's a little bit farther away, but that's okay. So. Oh yeah, look, this one, it's a, quite a bit smaller than half of the big shell, so that fits easily. If I can get it to line up here. I would have liked it better if they were as high as the fridge at least but not bad not bad all right let's see how we're gonna do this let's start on the left with non-food actually should we is there anything like uh, special we won't want here self-care maybe you know soaps Thinking, thinking. The the timer stopped too early, so it's still running a little bit. Oh, you joined my Discord. Nice. Please do check out the merch channel. Osaka. So someone was talking. Debbie. Debbie, of course. Debbie. <laughs> was talking about mouse mats that she needed one and she was she says i wish there was a freya mouse mat and he creates this enormous thing of freyas and puts it and and i put it on the merch so now there's this huge freya gaming mouse mat for sale in the, in the merch store it's glorious. Please just go take a look and tell him either on the Discord or on the merch store and tell him what you think about it because he loves feedback. He, he misses it sometimes when people don't really respond to his art. He spent hours on that and it looks great. I think I'm going to order one for myself. I'm quite sure I will actually. <laughs> I'm thinking, thinking, how are we going to set this up? I think I am going to do it like, uh, yeah, drinks and cans. I think I can have a bit more space now, though. Nice. I'm just thinking what we should put on here. 
I'm, I'm missing so many items that it's hard to tell. <laughs> They're actually selling things that are stuck in the shelves. That's just awesome. No, 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 no. You're in there. You're the only one in there. Everyone, last call. If you want to win a key to this game, enter the giveaway right now. And thanks all for the 34 likes. That's absolutely awesome. Yeah, it's just going for a couple more minutes. Less than five. But no, you're in there. You're good. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, what should we put here? I like the system of going from non-food to food. Should we just put like toilet paper in here? I don't have, I don't even have any, do I? Well, nothing for it. Let's go get some. Only way I'm gonna figure out how to set this up. Is, does he already have a new shelf in here? see because there's a little space over here well, I guess the items are coming here on the empty spaces probably all right let me check out the non-food first um oh if it I just now oh, I have diapers on that's quite cheap I need everything to be able to set up the shelving. I don't really care. Oh, well, wait, that's really, that's the price. Let me get one more of those. That's what I'm looking for, but I'm going to buy one of everything uh, just so we can set up the shelving. There is some more soap coming. I don't need you. I do need you. I don't need the hair oil. I do need the body oil. Yes. Okay, let's start with that. We're gonna set this up. He didn't know this game was real. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, we need to... Oh, wait. I get excited and then I forget to check my own stats. Okay, so I'm, I made a mess, right? How's my rating? 99%. <laughs> Nobody cares. <laughs> Sorry, this is fun. Two minutes left for anyone who wants to join the giveaway. But, uh... Last call. Right, let's do this. Oh, we need to do that. Press E. There we go. Um, I'm pro you know, I can put some of the shelving that I have in here. So I can put some of the boxes in there. Oh yeah, I did get a staff room upgrade. It's just such a weird bathtub because normally you would put such a bathtub in like an area you built, right? It's missing its lining. Also, the toilet is very big <laughs> I'm gonna split it into papers, cleaning, self-care, I think. Or should I do the self-care first? It would make more sense. Next toilet paper. Nah, it doesn't really matter, I think. Bought more boxes than I thought. Uh, sponge, air freshener. Nope. I'm blocking myself in there. Yeah, 
Yeah, something like paper cups. But let's put that in the I don't fucking know area. Um, I'll put the tissues here because I'm blocking myself there. Bleach. Cleaner. The toilet is huge. Yeah. Well, actually, the toilet is a normal size. If you comp if you see how high I am, it's a it's a little bit big, but it's you know for such a modern design, it's pretty okay. It's the bathtub that's just really really small. Look, if I stand in it, I can barely wet my big toe. <laughs> the other bathtub was way bigger, but I already sold that one. I'm, the reason I'm thinking is because the, um, the items for self-care aren't that many. I'm just thinking maybe I should put those separate. On the other hand, toilet paper and such needs to go on the bottom. Well, actually, you can go up and then... Uh, issues. Yeah, you need to go on the... On the bottom shelf. And you have to wrap papers. Right? Or should we put the diapers? Should we put the diapers? Oh, wait, that's... Where is it? Give me a pack of diapers. No, 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 no. This is not gonna work. Um, because I can't even put the second one next to there. Also, the diapers need to go in the bottom, I think. Yeah, it's too high. Nope, it doesn't work. So we're gonna move you guys over here. Okay, so we're gonna put... Two lots. What do we have? Big bottles go on the bottom. Let's see. Soap can go there. Shampoo over there. Oh boy, I can't hit the toothpaste. Oh no, I can. Hitting. Hold on. And then toothpaste over here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That works. Uh this is the other shampoo. Okay, so certain areas might have a little space left over. That's okay, because he's gonna add more in the future. So that's not a bad thing. It would just give me more freedom when, you know, new stuff arrives. Hey, Mr. Samir. Love from Qatar. Thank you very much. No chairs and tables because Nima does not rest. No, that is true. I can always uh, add that in the future, though. Yeah, the old shelves can go in the back. All right, let's pick a winner. Who shall it be of our one contestant? <laughs> it's Queen. MT's Queen won. What a surprise. 
Who'd ever guessed it? Who'd have thunk it? We would never have known. And now congratulations. If you could just hit me up, send me a message on Discord, this little DM, and I'll send you your key after the stream. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm just messing. This, this happened with the, the other DNA Army key uh, games too that I played on the channel. Because they gave me a lot of keys and eventually just run out of people who actually want to play it. I'm glad you're all here watching though. I'm having a good time. This is going to look great. I think I have a little bit too much kid shampoo, but that's okay. Yeah, I have a, I have a lot of space left over. We'll, we'll see how it works out. Okay, let's do this. I'm going to set the shelves up one by one and we'll see how it looks. Let me just grab the rest there now. Could, I, could make that three rows, honestly. Good paste. I'm hoping we can uh, stack that soon. Yeah, I'm so I'm doing this all in one go. Because otherwise this would not have been possible uh, to get it all neatly as I please. Um, yeah, so this is basically gonna be the diapers, I think. They need to be on the bottom. Uh, oh yeah, body oil. And I had a box of um, well, I wonder if that fits. I need to decide a little bit. Can you fit another bottle in there? Oh, no. It doesn't. I will figure it out. That's sad. That would have been nice if that had fit exactly. If I move this one a little bit more this way, hold on. Let's move. From, let's do it from the other side. Yeah, that does fit. A little bit of effort. Uh, where did I put those boxes? No, those are just my, my foods. Here. Uh, hair oil. Yes. There we go. Okay, we have a bit of space left over, but I already saw there's another soap going to be added uh, soon. Hey, Airblend, can you play? This is a single player game, I'm afraid. <laughs> you know, Kermit excitement. Yeah! <laughs> and yes, I did wave my arms with that. Sorry, you missed it. <laughs> you can sneak a little bit by putting some items through the back there if you don't see that anyway Yeah, toilet paper. It would be nice to be able to put at least two boxes of an item on a shelf. You know, give yourself a little bit more freedom with adding and such. Are you bigger than... You are bigger. I 
don't see that works. Okay, I'm curious. Does it now stick out through the store? No. The wall's thicker than that. Just checking. <laughs> uh, okay, then we have the wrapped papers. Did I not have... Yeah, there. I was going to say, didn't I have some on the shelf? Yes, I do. Yeah, this shelf is a lot less steep. And I know it's a design, but I would have liked it better if it was at least as deep as the more as the way cheaper shelves. Because this is supposed to be an upgrade. On the other hand, you know, we're going towards a more luxurious store with more delicate items and more delicate shelves. And I'm gonna talk like this for the rest of no I'm not. Okay, let's go. Um Yeah, I am gonna run into trouble with my big big stuff, I think. No, I'm not. Yeah. Give me some cornflakes. Hi, do you fit on here? You do. Perfect. Okay, the cornflakes are moving home. Because we need more space for Yeah. Cleaning stuff and washing stuff. I really, really wish I could put you guys on there. Oh, my music stopped. Yes, I'm still here. Thank you. Um, well, another option is put them on here. Put them on the top. Uh, yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to put the diapers on top of here. I'm gonna have to sneak a little bit through the wall to fit two on here nicely. There we go. What if I do you guys like so? That works. Okay, okay, that gives us more space. Mm. I like, yeah. Maybe. I mean, that's a lot of... Maybe it should go up here? Yeah. Doesn't really fit well. Okay, so I need two more bottom shelves. That's what I'm thinking about. Because I need... Um, softener and detergent. And... Hi, do you... Yeah, that one too. And these two. Well, I guess uh, softener and detergent are now a selection of their own. Congratulations. I'm sure we can fit some food above you somewhere. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We can go on this side. A bleach. And toilet cleaner. Can I fit three? Why do we have to feel I think these shelves. Oh no, they're just they're just one shelf. That's why it looks a little bit weird. Hmm. I'm trying to fit three on there. It's still sticking through. Oh well. Oh, good morning, everyone. <laughs> Door opened again. 
How am I doing? Because I keep losing track of that. I'm gonna have to buy some food and water for myself soon, I think. Especially water. Yeah, close one door. <laughs> means that yeah tea and coffee is gonna have their own their own little space i think because otherwise i can't even fit one box of tea on here spill the tea uh, cups yeah we're gonna put well actually the, the cup next to the toothpaste for now at least I'll have some on the shelf in case someone wants to buy it. Uh, the sponges can go with the papers. Or maybe above? You can't even see them if I put them there, can you? Hold on. They also fit here. Alright. Scheiße. <laughs> oh, oh no. Alright, so what else is too big? No, that one's good. What about you? Oh, can we... S hold on, if I do that, can I still put stuff above it? Yes, okay. Sometimes when it sticks out a little, you can't uh, put it there. Thanks, Pix. Yeah, I'll, I'll get to everything, no worries. Okay, so this one also needs to be on the bottom shelf, and this one too. That's... that's a real shame. Mm. Well, actually, I can just put these on top. Let's do that. Uh, hold on, I need my little stool. Yeah, n never pull, put anything with bleach above your head. The tip of the day. Um, <laughs> everything just look at everything just hanging around. It's great. simply stay there okay okay it's starting to look like an an actual real section Lots of space, very nice. Alright, let's put these boxes in so everything's nicely stocked. But these shelves are a lot less deep, so we're gonna need to have more width to every item. <laughs> Health and safety tips. 
Honestly, you don't want to get bleach on your clothes, <laughs> but that's, you know, I think that's a very generic life tip uh, for everyone. going to need a bit more space than the cleaner, clearly. Okay, here's the detergents. Oh, I picked up a bit too much of that. Well, we'll see how it goes. it's on the bottom there we go loading section put that one as far back as the other one it's not colliding with the oh it could maybe it's colliding with the yeah it is colliding with the, the leather care there that's okay though it still fits well so it's fine If push comes to shove, I can put that one up there, too, if it becomes a problem. I'm gonna have a lot of space left over. It's a shame I couldn't put you guys uh, If I could stack those diapers I could move some things up and, and the you know things like these if I could stack those Because then I could put some more up there and those could move over here to have more room for food what foods need to be on the bottom? I think just tea and coffee. Right? Let's finish this and let's check. Oh, that's a lot of cleaning spray still. It's fine, we'll just fill up the shelf. Uh, what are you? Oh, the paper cups. Oh, see, you, you know what? Let's put those next to the toothpaste. Who cares, right? I doesn't. Very good. Okay. And that space is going to be for the new soap I saw in the pictures on Steam. There you go. We have a lot of space left over. We'll see how it goes. I, I don't want to be too strict right now because I don't know what's going to happen with, you know, additional items. Also, I want to give the chips and the candies and the cans a lot more space than they had before. Okay, so honestly, you guys, well... Um, Yeah, 
you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna uh, space out the drinks and the cats. And then we're gonna see how much space is left over. I'm gonna put you guys on the shelf though, so maybe we can sell some of you. Hmm. Honestly, this is. Yeah, that's cornflakes too. It would be nice to have those close together. Hmm. The only downside I see is that drinks and cans don't really fit well together. <laughs> I basically put them together because they're all small items. There, so at least they're on the shelf. Um, yeah, what should we do? drinks with the sweets or the or the chips would make more sense and then put the cans with the sauces and the mac and cheese i think that honestly would make more sense so we could put like drinks Cookies and then chips and cereals and then cans with sauces and whatever's left over. And then here, yeah, whatever extra items they're going to be adding in the future. We have a lot of cookies though. I'm not entirely sure if that's gonna fit. I'm gonna have to sort it out. Right, I have a couple of more of those letter care. There we go. Um and no worries, I'll fill everything up again. Okay, we're out of water. We have 10k. I don't think we need to be worried about uh, running out of money. Mm. Can we do the drinks at the opening of the store? I can just buy one of each. Well, I need some water. A lot of water is very cheap right now. <laughs> Save that one bug. I do need some chips for food. There. Um, okay, so we have to drink, so we're gonna add cookies, right? A biscuit. Now the question is, this biscuit, is it sweet? No, it's a cracker. It looks sweet. Baked in sunflower oil, less saturated fat. Honestly, that's so debatable, that saturated fat story. Hello, how much sugar is in here? <laughs> Could you tell me? <laughs> uh, okay, guys, sweet or savory? Sweet or not? Yay or nay? It's from a bakery. It says an original cracker. It, it l the picture looks sweet to me, but it might not be. It's a cracker. Ritz crackers. Is that sweet, Thomas, or not? I d I'm not familiar with Ritz crackers. 
Well, I have cookies. I mean, we have a lot of cookies. I bought all of those. But here are the oats. So this is just debatable item. <laughs> Literally debatable, like we can debate about it. I don't remember if I bought it now. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> uh, it's fine to buy another one. Get like 10 of those boxes on a single shelf. I have oil. Salty and sweet. Sweet, savory. Oh, which one is it? That coffee, we needed that too. <gasps> Rice! Oh, damn it, these two need to go on the big spots too, I think. I'm gonna buy some boxes to test it out. Uh, hold on, that's not how we do Okay, so they're, they're an in-between item. They can be both savory or sweet. That means wherever we have space left over, that's where we're going to put it. Wow, it can't decide what it is. <laughs> do I have any cookie? Well, I have well, some of those bits, but I don't have any cookies, do I? That's going to make this easier. Um, let me see. If I put the drinks here, that's gonna make it easier. Oat cookies. I'm not sure if we have enough space. Well, I can put some things on top as well. I could put the bigger bottles there, the cans there, and then have the cookies here. And then there on the bottom, we'll see what I need to put on the bottom. It's gonna be more important, honestly, space wise. Because if an item doesn't fit on the shelf, you can't put anything above it. Oh, wait, those water bottles are for here. There we go. Very chips as well. There we go. All right, cookies. The biscuits go over here because we don't know yet. The tuna cans is just to space it out. Drinks. This is fun though, just deciding where everything needs to go. More curry chips go over here. More water. Oh, stuck in the door. Tropical drink, blueberry drink, sand cake, so sweet. Is it coffee now? Well, no, that's always been coffee. It was the drinks that were called coffee. Okay, more cola. All the cola, actually. This one needs to go for here. Okay, we have enough food and water to last us at least a day. <laughs> Cookies and rice. Okay, uh, you can go over there. So these three items, the question is what needs to go on the bottom? Now, obviously the coffee. Oh, I didn't need to. I think the coffee can just fit next to the tea. Can I put you backwards a little bit? Yeah, that's for, that works out great. Can I have 
little space left over in case I have an extra tea box put there. Okay, Tuna, do you need to go? No, you don't. Um, that means I'm going to put you over here for later decisions. Rice does need to go on the bottom. So you, the rice needs to go here. Only two in a row. So that the rice gets... Oh yeah, the sorry, the, the chips is sticking through. Right? Sticking to the bottom. That's why it's not working. There you go. Fix it. All right. I'm thinking if I put the tea, coffee, and rice at the wrong way around. It doesn't really matter that much. Alright, so what can we do here? A lot of cans. So... That this is not a bad spot for the... So it would probably be smarter for me to work from the other side since this is this is like leftover space. I can always fix it again. Alright, we have... How many cans do we have? We have watermelon. Cola, tropical drink. Uh, hello, are you so? No, you're cola. You're you're the soda. Okay. Water bottle. We have that. Blueberry drink. Okay. Don't put the blueberry next to the watermelon. That's very small. <laughs> small day is uh, a shift in color there. And then cola, energy drink, what's that at the bottom? That's the energy drink. Here's a soda bottle. Trying to measure it out a little bit before we start stacking this. I just missed those boxes twice. Okay, no, that works, that works. Okay, so all the drinks go up there. So what about the cookies? We have three shelves for cookies. If I move these cans. Where should we put the cans? Oh yeah, we also have salt and sugar. We put those there. The staples. Let's see, you guys can go with the cereals. Um, we put the sauces here, maybe. No, we're gonna put the sauces with the cans. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, let me just get the rest. 
Uh, no, I don't have to go this way. Pizza hasn't uh, been added yet. How often do I stream? Uh, more often than I've done recently. <laughs> That's a weird answer. Um, I've, been, I've been getting a lot of migraines lately, annoying enough. It's also the weather shift that's bothering me. So I try to stream at least five days a week with a couple of days with double stream. It just doesn't always work out that way. So sorry about that. Let's see. Uh, tomorrow I will do a stream, you know. Bad luck notwithstanding. I did buy you. I bought all the cookies. I bought all the drinks. I'm not even looking at the price. I just need one of each item. We have eggs. Coffee tea we have. Sauces. Uh, Thursday, I need. we need to do the big shopping. By which I mean the Christmas shopping. Uh, my stream afterwards depends a little bit on how it goes. Oh yeah, I feel lots better. Thank you, Jewel. Uh, otherwise I wouldn't have streamed. I hate headaches. I never know what it causes. We had a Christmas party Saturday. And as the day went, as the night went on, evening, it was the evening. Um, I just started coughing more and more. And I wasn't sick or anything. There was just something in the air there. I couldn't, it could have that could have cost it. Could have been a weather switch because we went from freezing to bloody hot for the time of year. This is gonna be one of the warmest Christmases ever. Here. Pretty really stupid. Alright guys, so we're gonna do Um Okay, the question I have is do I have more chips or more cookies? So let's put them together, shall we? Let's see, this is just dressing. Uh, jelly? Peanut butter? What are you? Two okay. cats. Then stay. I don't know why I went in a circle there. It's fun though. Uh, candy is actually gonna go in here. Cereals? Mashed avocado. No, avocado, sorry. I think it'll have um, a PS5. Well, here's the thing he can't use anything in this game that's in any way copyrighted. So, there are consoles in the game, and there's, by, there might be more in the future, but they will never be called that. You know what I mean. Uh, I thought I had... No, I guess not. It's gonna be a cold Christmas here. The joke is that European weather will almost always, well, I, I dare to say 90% of the time at least, will be the opposite weather of Europe. Uh, gum. I think we can do that in there as well. So the moment, so it was very cold here and you guys was pretty mild and then the moment it's just switched around, uh, yeah, it switched around for you too. So it got hotter here and the US got, and it has to do with the air streams also, you know, El Ninja, El Nino, those babies. Uh, where did I have the sausage? Get there. Um, sugar. That one can go here. Brezels. Uh, that's chips for me. At least I counted under chips. This is a can. 
pasta is just general something sauce. Cereal. Canned fruits might go with the cans. Like uh, things like mayo, peanut butter, um, jelly, and canned fruits are a bit of a outstand outsidey. Flour goes over here. Oat flakes. I'll put that with the cereal. Frying oil is also one of those leftover things. Okay, the answer is there are just as many cookies in the game as there are chips. Fuck me. <laughs> Okay, so they're they are gonna need like three three areas each. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Maybe we should do the cornflakes here. Sugar and flour. Cans and um, like leftover foods, chips, and cookies here. Uh, what what else could we do with the? We could also put all the cans here. Put all the little stuff together. And then have like cookies, chips, cereals? No, because then we don't have a shelf for the leftovers. And leftovers, I mean tuna cans and frying oil and eggs. <clears throat> the police station. Well, it's better than the sledge. Xorp. Sorry, buddy. I didn't see you there. Um, oh, I have a good question. Where's the where's the frying oil and how, how tall are you? Hi, how tall are you? Yeah, that's what I thought. You bloody bastard. <laughs> I hate you. Uh, that means that I'm going to move the tea and coffee to the cookie side. That makes sense to me. Fight me. <laughs> right? I mean, tea and coffee goes great with cookies. Better than frying oil, honestly. Makes more, more sense to me, at least. <laughs> the super mega sun, that sounds awesome. Cookies? Oh, do I have enough space for the cookies then if I do it like that? I do. Hi. Honestly, I could... Oh no, that doesn't fit. Botheration! I have all the, bo all the boxes there. I'll make sure everything's in there. Are you still in the fridge? Yes! Okay, perfect. <laughs> If I put that fridge, like, here, I think that would fit. I can put the cans in there. And the bigger bottles, well, some of them can still go in the fridge, maybe. Okay, let's do this. I know sugar and flour is usually at the bottom, but I'm also working a little bit on size. Meaning that the lower, the bigger it is, the lower it's going to be on the shelf. Because honestly, that just looks good. Now, how many cereals can I fit on one shelf? Uh, hold on. Uh, you are cereal, ring cereal. 
I need one cereal. Where is the berry cereal? Okay, I didn't I didn't need to be that specific honestly. I have a bit more space than that. Which is nice. It means you don't have to stack that uh, that strictly. Okay, that works. I just think I didn't put it far enough back. Oh no, actually I can't go further back. Perfect. Okay, let's put the cereals in there, because then that's done. Oh, sorry, I keep hopping on the boxes when I don't mean to. It just happens. Um. Oh. Accidentally picked one of the wrong ones. Okay. Luckily, we only have to do this once. As in, we only have to set up the thing up once. I think two of these are not going to fit perfectly. Go back a little. There you go. Well, that works perfect. Um, oh yeah, so there's going to be the rest of the cereal items. Cerealicious items. Like the oats. Oh, music stopped again. Yes, I'm still here. Okay. And... I first put this under the chips because I thought there were, or with candy basically, because I thought there were banana chips, but it's not. It's banana cereal. Can you just, oh, hold on. You're the one that's in the way. Stand over there in the corner of shame. Have more of the exterior delicious things. There's thing. oh, here's the oat flakes. Oh, I was pressing F, but it didn't take. There we go. There's clearly space left over. We'll see if I need that space. Then we can shuffle things around. Like frying oil. Nuts might be something I just put with the chips. Alright, frying oil needed to be at the bottom. That was it. It needs more space. That's all right. Yeah, here we go. Here's the rest of the banana cereal. And that's cheese. Okay. Oh, 
going to go eat and drink. This one's empty. Until I... Uh... Well, fruit and veggies might have to wait till next time. Because this is a lot of work. Wow, have I been streaming for three and a half hours already? Huh, it doesn't feel like that long. Okay, that, this has become a little bit of the bullshit shelf, honestly. So, let me see. How many space are we going to need for cans? Two shelves? <laughs> bop everywhere now. Um, yeah, when we can stack the, the jars and such, that's gonna be a lot better. But for now, this will work. Uh, there we go. Got it. Yeah, things got a little bit stuck. Um, okay, let me have the corn. Measure out with the piece, then we have tomato paste over there. Oh, where did I put all the cans? There, okay, perfect. Some fruit. It's tomato. No, wait. Oh, that's jelly. Three rows, honestly, with all the space I have now. So much room for activities. And doggy food. And one. Oh, there's still one floating in there. Hold on. Maybe we should put dog food separately. <laughs> Hold on, maybe that maybe dog food should go with non-food next to the toothpaste. That would help. <laughs> Honestly, it's not. Yeah, I always have a separate pet uh, pet section so that people don't eat the pet food. Um, I mean, what other reason is there, right? Right. Um, the tuna cans can go perfectly under there. Mm -hmm. Let's put in the shelves where we have made a decision. Makes it easier to see where we want to rest. In the cans. It, it fits a little bit. No, okay. That's fine. It just sticks out a little. It's okay. It's just too now. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, hit my mouse. Okay, so these items are basically going to be the turkiest of the bunch, though. We have some space left over here, too. Let's start on this side. Oh, wait, let me move this away so we have all the room. Mm -hmm. 
I'm. He had so many cans in part one that I suspect he's gonna add more cans to this one. So if there's anywhere I want to leave more space, it's gonna be with the cans. <laughs> I don't know anything, but I'm not risking it. Let's see, the enchilada kit goes with the mac and cheese, I think. I'm really curious. So what? After all this mess, I'm still 100. <laughs> percent So I always have something they like, at least. Okay, we need something for the sh for the sauces. Probably here. Yeah, that's those three. So eggs. Where could we put the eggs? Honestly, the eggs wouldn't fit that badly with the sugar and the flour. You know, the staples of life. Mashed avocado could, could still go there. We have sandwiches. This is all jars. Yeah, no, that works. That works out. Okay. Um, Can-wise, I think we can easily go with three cans a row. Uh, per, per. Okay, let's start with water. Let's finish this. Don't put it too narrow. Uh, it's gonna be a pain to stack these shelves. Okay. This is doable. We can we can do this. Okay. Not so much left now. Of course, when I'm done here, I'm gonna have to move and refill the fridging too. But honestly, that can wait till next time too. Mm. Oh yeah, I'm missing the the soda bottles. And. Oh, I accidentally picked up. Tropical drink. Uh, the energy drink, sorry. Mm, cola can. Give me the big bottle. A rag? It's not a rag, it's a rug. Hold on. <laughs> Oh, I picked up the small one by accident. Perfect. That's very fizzy. Yeah, the texture's a bit odd on that one, but that's also things he's working on. Alright. Okay, so if we have the cola here, the cola can't go here. Or is it is that weird what I have set up now? Ah, who cares? Um, <laughs> can, the question is, how many, how wide do we need them? Three or four? Okay, let's keep, give me some energy drinks. Let's start with three. These cans are also quite small, so honestly three is more than enough. This is watermelon. No, wait, we're gonna wait. We're gonna work from the other side first. Oh. I need to put money on my cart for the bills. Oh, 
Yeah, I thought my rep would plummet uh, with putting all this up, but uh, we're doing fine so far. Um, what I'm thinking is what's happening is that people who might not be able to find what they really wanted, there's enough in the store that they pick something else. Man, this is looking so much better already. Um, what am I missing here? The blueberry drink, I think. Someone bought that. I don't know if this is gonna fit. Uh, I could put the energy drinks on two rows since it's such a small can. So just of course the soda faces the other way as these drinks do myself enough space to you know make mistakes or not be as neat but still be able to fill okay last soda can yeah, that's not going to fit, is it? That works. I mean, obviously, I need to add more, but this works. <clears throat> Customers need some mysterious, yes. They are. I do want the cookies here, but I think I'm going to run out of space. I can put the biscuits, act like they're crackers and put them there. So let me see here. What all do we have? Cake? Right, we have these packages too, that's right. They take up a lot less space. Uh, no, the, hold on, that's that one. This is the oat cookie. And chocolate cookies. Yeah, the shelf is so small. Can't wait until we can stack these items. I need a whole shelf just for these cookies. Yeah, these as well, this, these need a lot of space. They're just a tiny bit smaller than these ones. I need the uh, oat cookies. The trap cookies, I call them. Because they look like chocolate chip, and then you bite into them and they're oats and raisins. Uh huh. If I could stack them, I'd only need one row.
And then I could make a double row of these. Uh, well, I guess uh, you're gonna live up here. It's fine. Is, these cookies don't need that much space anyway. Uh, hold on, because if they only need one row... It'll work out when we can stack items. I gave Debor my... Basically he told me which ones he was planning. And then I added a couple of items that I think should be stackable. Like eggs. Okay. Not bad. I mean, I would like to stack them. But or t or t what, what would really help is if these were turned on their sides, basically like these, but that's okay. Um, all right, what all do we have? Corn snack, that's this thing. Onion chips, that are those. Okay, let's start with these babies here. Curry. That's also a curry. This is gonna be the green one. Uh, yeah, pepper. That's the one I need. Cheese? Yeah, curry. That one. That's the one I'm looking for. Okay, this is a bit of a bigger bag. You can go over there, along with the corn snacks, I think. The nuts can go over here. Pretzels? Oh, maybe we should... No, wait. We'll put the chips there. We'll put the corn and the pretzels there, so people, you know, don't accidentally buy them. Cheesy chips? Yeah, there. And those are the onion ones. And then... Or should we do the crackers on the bottom? There's nothing really to put next to the nuts, is there? <laughs> we don't really have any other... To... Hey, Rose! There's Casper. 17 months. I was waiting for the... Notification, but it doesn't seem to be coming true. Change plants. Um, no, I like to have the bags together. Let's put the crack. Yeah, we'll put the crackers here. Hi, Casper. How are you doing? <laughs> not coming through but thank you very much for long time support I have just completely refamped this section of the store it was a lot of work but it was fun well it still is fun I'm, I'm not done yet <laughs> not much to go now though <laughs> she sat with 20 boxes there he is! That took a long time. Botheration. <laughs> oh, maybe I should have done it the other way around.
Another option is moving the drinks up there and then having more room for cookies. But honestly, it's fine like this. We're gonna get more uh, more items anyway. In the future, I might have to change things then. You're good? Great. I think I still had a box of these. Uh, pretzels. Uh, they're a bit full on onion chips right now. Uh, cheese chips, they Let's go here. Pistachios. You know, we could use some peanuts. Oh, yeah, the candy. That's right. Did they all do that? Hold up. Did you see that little hop skip? No. Okay, I was just in the way. Just checking. Okay, let's sort this out. Hold up. Um, where's the fruit? Okay, then you have jelly. And of course we need peanut butter. Wait, the dog food we want to put over there. Yeah, there's the peanut butter. What else do we have? Mayonnaise. Tomato paste. Yeah, that's that one. Peas, we have those. And canned corn. Then we have the sauces. And, well, the eggs can go over there. That's that cheese. I'm trying to. I think we can put all these jars uh, in a stack of three. Oh, sorry, in three rows, I meant. It's gonna fit easily. So we need. One more spot for fruit. The peanut butter goes over here. In the future, if more needs to be put there, we can always uh, change it up again. For now, we have more than enough space to do three rows.
What space left over even? the last one uh, for those of you who are curious uh, yes this is how I set up my <laughs> my uh, my kitchen cabinets just with more stacking we have one with spices and one with like sauce things and then the shelf under that is the baking items and yeah I'm, I'm fine though it's okay on the edge no hold on who the hell wants super mild and well actually i would get super mild enchilada kit and then add a uh, hot sauce oh yeah sure why not go sit over there i don't care anymore where's my pasta There. Oh, oh well, no, I think we just sold some. Um, no, I have a little bit of space over there. Oh, I'm gonna move. I have to move all those enchilada kits, aren't I? Okay, hold on. Give me a box. There we go. As the pasta would be nice to be able to put. Two rows. Running back through my old line, but you leave it burning. Speaking tongues in my head, yeah. That's the way you want it. She called me baby, you know, wasting time. But how can I let it go? There you go. Okay, sauces. Um, oh yeah, the mashed avocado. It's one of the items. Oh well, actually, put it put it right here with the snacks. The sandwich, after all. A wall. Okay, let me see. So this is sauce, ketchup, salad dressing, general dressing. Almost done, guys. <laughs> wow, I'm actually impressed with myself. All right, let's move. Let's move over the. Yeah, let's try that. Let's see how many eggs we can fit in there. Uh, oh, actually, this one is. Nah, that doesn't look nice.
Oh, I'm hungry and thirsty, hold on. Maybe I should put the eggs elsewhere. I do have the top shelves, but I don't like putting tiny items on there. Mm, well, honestly, why don't we just put the eggs here? It's fine. They need a lot of space since we can't stack them. There. That's fine. Oh yeah, dog food. Last one, I think. Well, I have a couple of supplies. I'll check if I can move those in now. Hold on, I want to see the doggo. There he is. And we have some space left over, but that's perfect. Because he's already announced that new items will be added. And I can shuffle things around then. Okay, we have a couple of chippies. What else do I have? Kit shampoo. Uh, I don't see it pretty full. Oh, more dog food? Oh yeah, why not? There's, I mean... <laughs> didn't put this out very neatly, did I? Much better. Yeah, just an angle view could make a big difference in stacking items. How neat you are, how good it looks. There we go, that's better. Eggs in the fridge. The thing is, uh, I know the fridge looks really empty right now because that's a need. I need to stock everything in the fridge. Um, I don't want to add another fridge because it fits perfectly in that spot there. Of course, I might have to in the future if he adds more fridge items. Oh, uh, wait, didn't I have another box of kit shampoos? I have some corn snacks. Fit. Yeah, we did have another box of kit <laughs> shampoo here, but also full. And three diapers, but that really doesn't fit there. Could fit a little bit of this up here still, though. There we go. Those are the chips. All right, looking good with space left over for future additions. I'm happy with this. Make sure. Get rid of some of these boxes. I'm also em just letting this run empty because we're gonna next time. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna move the fridge now, but we're gonna... There we go. Uh, set up the vegetable area with the new shelves. I did a lot of testing today, too. 
So, let me see. Mm. Well, yeah, we'll just go stand there for a little bit. Oh, I sold a bunch of those gaming PCs. Let me quickly see if we can find them. Must have been a big, big amount. No, that's the daily stuff. Now, I haven't slept in a while, so it might be, uh... Might be a while back. Oh, here we go. 1,046. Yeah, I have 13k. Well, let me see. Is there anything else? Let's buy this. Oh, no, I need to put that on the card. Okay. Upgrades are all done, so I need 500 on the card. I think if I hurry, I can take a quick nap. And then, uh, I'll probably sort the rest next time. <laughs> it's my hands hurting. That was a lot of work. <laughs> that was fun, though. It's looking a hundred times better than with those old shelves. And despite refilling all the shelves with at least one box, I, was, I still have 13k. That means we can buy all the shelves we need for the veggie section. And then it's on to... Well, the, and the fridge. We're going to set up the fridge too next. Not perfectly yet, because I want to put the ice cream into the freezers. Which are fridges, but they look like freezers. But... Unless I can stack items, that's... yeah, that's not gonna happen. So one of the things Debor mentioned that he's working on right now is the fact that if you stack items, the cashier actually sells you the bottom item. Um, and he wants... yeah, then you have floating items. So what he wants is to sell the top item, obviously. Yeah, this works nicely, actually, for the drinks. That's going to save me a lot of fridge space. I think I want it inside, though. I think I can put it here, but I'll sort that out next time. I'm going to set up the veggie section. I'm going to move these fridges. Just And if everything works out, that'll be tomorrow. Um, move these fridges a little bit to the right. And then re restock them with everything. What I'm gonna he do here exactly is gonna depend on how white the veggie section is gonna be. But honestly, this looks pretty good. Yeah, I'm gonna need to restock this too. I sold a bunch of those. I'll buy new stuff and such. But yeah, this is gonna be uh, houseware, electronics, and gaming items. Or should I put the gaming items here? If I have space, I could put that table. That table is a lot wider, though. It would look nice. I could buy a bunch of those white tables. Those might be a little bit smaller. It would break up the those the straight lines a bit. I think that would look nice. Yes, music. But uh, yeah, this is a lot of fun. But, uh, oh, almost 50 likes, you guys are awesome. That's amazing. What do you think, guys? Does it look better? <laughs> I do. <laughs> boy, oh boy. That's a big difference with... Uh, with those shelves. Take a picture. Oh yeah, there's the mouse sensitivity. Honestly, mine is fine. Uh, 
Um, trying to see how to make a nice thumbnail with uh, with my beautiful shelving. Yeah, I can't really take a good picture of the extension here, but that's okay. Yeah, that's not the most interesting picture. Yeah, you can stack shelves, that's true. Now I'll see what, what works as a thumbnail. Would be nice to get a little bit of these veggies on there. There we go. Um, you know, I don't think we sold a single melon. I don't think this actually works. I think it's too far away from the building. I don't see a line anywhere though. Sometimes you have like a area line. Because this fridge does work. But this one doesn't seem to. No. Well, here's what we can do. Uh, my head back. Let me put those melons back inside. They can sell where we work on the fridge next time. We can do the whole fruit and veggie section. I'm, I'm hoping it'll empty a little bit. Not a big deal. I mean, I can shuffle stuff around. At least we got rid of all the crates. Hey, Lan, how you doing? <laughs> added my <laughs> added your like. Thank you. That got us to forty nine. Who's gonna be the fiftieth? Um. Hey, Michaelio. Do I have the truck? Uh, buy it for electronic stuff. Oh, yeah, um, you know what, you make a good point. I finally have enough money to splurge. I can go buy a truck. We'll do that next time, promise. We'll, we'll buy the truck and we'll set up... Some people just do a little hop skip on my... On my beautiful carpet. It's, it's perfect. It's so realistic. My... You know those those things that are in front of the store that, uh, like, you know, catch rain so you don't slip? Uh, not yet, he's working on the rain, actually. Um, my mother really fell once. Well, she doesn't, work, she doesn't walk that well. And she just tripped on a little edge that ro rose up uh, from the floor. These things are a hazard to your life, I swear. They're more dangerous than a wet floor. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Box out of the way. I need some thumbnails. <laughs> Sorry, just stick with me. <laughs> that's how your grandpa broke his hip. Well, that sucks. 
but yes, it is uh, quite dangerous. Uh, however, wet floors are also dangerous, so yeah, it's a bit of a choice to have to make, I guess. That box is really annoying. There we go. shiny face. Okay, so next time it's gonna be, well, I might have to refill a couple of these items again, but yeah, the, uh, the fridge and the veggie section and we're gonna get the truck. And hope maybe if I get to it, I'll start on the non-food section too. And work towards the perfect store. And after that, I'll probably wait a bit until we get more updates. So I'm having a lot of fun with this. We'll see how it goes. You know what? Let's put this one here. Get rid of that ugly table. But we can buy some prettier things for our store now. Perfect. Hey everyone! Well, John, if you hurry, you can be the 50th like of the evening. <laughs> oh, you see 50? Oh, great. We're already there then. I have a delay. You guys see it earlier than I do. I, get, I only get to see it after it's... Uh, maybe it's verified or something? I don't know. That, that sounds like something YouTube would do, though. Because it takes... Um, when you first start streaming... You get like to see your amount of views almost immediately, but as you get higher in views, you uh, it actually takes a while to get the real number because they start verifying things, verifying views, which makes perfect sense because you know people buy bots. Yeah, I like it. It's perfect. It's uh. Wait, did we just sell all those? Yeah, we did. <laughs> we, love, we sold a lot of cornflakes. We have space left over for future items, which are going to come soon. 27th uh, is going to be the next update. You know, he doesn't change his mind. I see 50 now. <laughs> nice, I'm always one behind. <laughs> Alright, everyone. It's, uh, yeah, it's almost 3 a.m. I'm gonna call it a night. I had a great time. Thank you so much for the 50 likes. It's awesome. Everything's gotten a bit emptier while I worked, but we got all this stocked up again. And, most importantly, sorted. So everything has a spot. I might change a little as I, you know, some items might need a little bit more space, but that's okay. So, things coming in the future, there's more items. He added um, a toy store, so the toys are coming soon. Uh, may maybe in end of December, maybe January, somewhere around there, everything's coming. Uh, decoration store for decorations for us, though I just gave him the idea to also make them sellable, so he might change that. Uh, stacking, he's working on that. Um, he wants to make sure things don't float so <laughs> that's the thing uh i can appreciate i don't really care that much but yeah it's a thing make it more realistic uh rain he's also working on rain i saw a picture of that he's working on a lot of things so we'll see what comes first you know what gives him trouble takes a bit longer it's all good more items in the Jabber store also coming soon. I forgot to check one thing. Hold on. Hold on. I'm saying goodbye. But he changed something at the butcher.
Uh, hold on, hold on. Butchers this way. Butchers the other way. That's right. I hope no one left yet. <laughs> I don't think so. Hold on. Just, I just remembered that the road map... Yeah, here, this way. This horrid road. bigger fridge I want it I want that fridge is it a is it or not maybe I'm mistaken um but uh, yeah the cows are gone honestly I thought that was greatly brutal that's a shame yeah they're gone Guess he got sick and tired of the dead by daylight remarks on this guy. Right? It's a hobby. I like the hanging cows. I thought it was funny. I mean, some people may be a little bit too sensitive about these things. Forget that it's pixels instead of real life. Nima Road's not here yet, guys. I'm sorry. Hi, Auntie. Bye, Auntie. <laughs> okay, but I checked now uh, what's changed. So we have a new bathroom in the in the house. Well, bathroom as in we have a room for a bathroom. He added doors to the bedroom. And he added this room. Which you can now make into a bathroom. When I'm done with my store, we can do that. <laughs> or when I feel like it. You here to stay? I'm not. I was just saying goodbye, but I forgot to show everyone what changed at the butcher. I'm still having a lot of fun. Um, you know what we could... No, I want to do that next time. So, um, let me put some money on the cart for bills, so we don't run into that problem there we go next time i'm gonna buy myself the bigger truck so we can get all the items we need from the from the non-food store from not jabba and the butcher i'm gonna set up our veggie section with these shelves more of these look auntie i spent the entire stream <laughs> I spent the entire stream setting up this shelving and sorting out everything where everything goes. It looks great. It fits exactly too with that uh, that extra little shelf there. Uh oh. I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm too fat to fit in there. Oh no. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna change the fridge section just, you know, like five centimeters to the right. Um, align it with that wall, fill it all back up again, I'm gonna set up the veggie section and after that we'll see if I have time to set up the non-food section, the electronics. Uh, the clothing is done, but I might refill that. Well, I have to refill that. So we have the gaming store, the electronics store and the houseware store to go. There's basically three sections. So there's probably gonna be like housewares, uh, electronics and then gaming something like that that looks nice ink stack the fridges on top of each other oh I didn't test how long it takes something to spoil I'm sorry I forgot Huh, 
It still counts as in the fridge. Hilarious. Okay. I mean, I guess she could. Do you really want to? <laughs> no. Oh, oh, hold on. Allah stole me. There we go. Just to be sure. I'll fix the rest of the fridge uh, next time. You could put... Well, I don't know. Is there a smaller fridge you could stack? That would be hella funny. <laughs> oh, yeah. While I was setting all of this up, despite me buying one of each item, expensive for cheap, uh, I sold a lot of those stuff. Uh, the a bunch of computers are from over a thousand, so yeah, I made a lot of money. Yeah, it's too tall. I want that freezer. Where should, where should we put the freezer? You know what? The freezer could actually go with the... I'll, I'll see how it works out when I get it. I'm not getting it until we can stack, because it's not useful. Way too small. All right, everyone, <clears throat> I'm going to wrap it up. Uh, yeah, so lots of changes done. Lots of changes coming. I'm, I have a lot to do next time. Hopefully it'll be tomorrow. Depends a little bit on how the shopping goes, because you know how it is to shop right before Christmas. Nobody like. No, no, wait, I lied. We're going on Thursday. Tomorrow is Wednesday. That's right. The, the, the shops are open later on Thursday, so we decided to go on Thursday. I love it. I'm keeping that. I'm keeping that there just for the hop skip. It's hilarious. I see he walks normally. He walks normally, but the other one said hop skip. <laughs> Try hopping with a foot of new snow on the ground. Um, oh no, he does. I guess it depends on the character. Weird. Um... Yeah, we don't have, we didn't get any snow. We got some frost, and now it's just warm again. So, eh, can you do? Buy all my shit. Yeah, <laughs> look how look how empty my shelves are again. The never-ending nightmare, just like just like laundry, <laughs> always stacking. All right, everyone. As always, I'll be on the Discord for a bit longer if you want to come hang out and chat. Uh, please check out the new mouse mat Osaka designed for us. It's a big one for on the desk. It's, it's really big. Um, I, I asked him to make a smaller one too, but that's coming. I mean, I know yeah, he's a, he has a full-time job. He's not an artist by, you know, work. So he doesn't always have time, but he made that today. So no, no, yesterday. Today we decided what colors everyone wanted, so they voted on red and blue. So red and blue are now in the store. Yeah, that hop is just too glorious. So I'm really uh, happy with that. Christmas merch is in the store for a little bit longer still, if you want to go check that out. That's fun. And, uh, lots and lots of merch. I have way too much merch, but I love it all. I have also merch for kitties. Um, because I have a lot of adult viewers <laughs> uh, who have children. So I thought, why not add some nice Freya shirts for kids? And for the dogs, too. <laughs> Even for, for the pets get a Freya. All right, everyone. I wish you good night. I'll see you all tom probably, yeah, very likely tomorrow, I hope. Let me take care of myself here for a sec. I'm really happy that I finished those shelves, because that was a lot of work. You know, setting up the shelves, not that bad, but uh, deciding where everything goes. <laughs> Oop. Okay, perfect. That's all sorted. Yeah, we really need to refill stuff. All right. I'll see y'all on the Discord. I'll see y'all next time. Good night. Sleep well. Or not. You know, if you're from the other side of the world. Have a good day in that case. Bye-bye.